Crafty friends, Jen Cassell here. I'm back with another Scrap Diva Design Team project. Uh, this is also a video response for Happy Girl Tiff's 50th Pink Lemonade Birthday Challenge. Uh, she has a challenge going on over on IG. I will link it in the description box. And it's a pink lemonade embellishment box. Uh, you also have to send a wand or a shaker of some sort, and then there's a whole bunch of extra points as well. Uh, I was super inspired by the theme. I have been loving this pink lemonade collection that I picked up from Creative Fabrica. Uh, I will link that too. And also for my subscribers, I am doing a free month of Creative Fabrica. Um, I will link that as well. This is for Scrap Diva Designs. This is her website here, all of her socials on the back. And then don't forget to use that hashtag Scrap Diva Designs because there is some great inspiration there. So for this project, I use the Mason Jar Mini Album Die and I turned it into an embellishment box. Now I am going to be doing a tutorial on this. I am going to start doing the tutorial tutorial uh, today, so I should have it uploaded by tomorrow. Um, when I have it uploaded, I will link it as well. I used a bunch of fun dies from the shop. So up here, you're going to see the double loop bow, uh, the large Sakura die that comes with the flower pot uh, gift card holder, and then of course you'll see the leaves from the original flower die. Uh, in addition to, I used this mini banner. This came out, I want to say last year around Christmas time, and it's one of my favorite dies from the shop. I just love it. I did a lot of dimension on this, as you can see. The um, strawberry lemonade thing here, this is from Cricut, I believe. And then you'll see some of the lemon die cuts that I did and I just did a a video for YouTube and I will link that as well in case you guys missed it because it is really really cute uh, I do have it right here and then last but not least we have the sunshine from the summer words 2 that just came out in the July release but super fun shaker I made a cute shaker mix for this I have these lemon clay pieces uh, tucked away and I could not wait to use them and I did some strawberries as you can see and then there's some um, grapefruit that I just kind of thought looked like pink lemons, you know, but super fun. And let's check out what's inside. So this is a cu really cute box that I came up with. I love this. And inside I'm sharing with her some of the die cuts that I did. And then I did this adorable little embellishment right here. The sweet is a Scrap Diva die as well. That came out in the baby bundle uh, words. And then there are some of the large Sakura, obviously. And then uh, this is the foam flower that she released last month. And then these are some of the leaves from the flower pot, I believe. I've also included some of these mini shaker sunglasses. Absolutely love them. I shared these on Insta uh, when I showed my jelly basket, and I'll probably do a video on that as well. So this is a die that I haven't played with that was released last summer. It is the pineapple shaker die, and I love how this turned out. I used the summer words to a little foam flower to top off my sunglasses in the back. Those sunglasses, they come in a large and a small really cute and then this is the layered mini bow that i used popped off with one of the um foam flowers as well so cute i love this and then i gifted her one of the cute little flowers and then inside i have a yellow macaroon with some um charms and beads and stuff so, and then you also can include the wand and I'm just going to share with her a uh, couple of the ones that I had created. Once again, I showed that in my last video with the, uh, 
berry basket. But thank you for watching and thank you Tiff for hosting such a fun birthday challenge. I'm really excited to send this out to you and I hope you really like it. Check back tomorrow for this tutorial on the cute little mason jar box that I created. And don't forget to use my coupon code GEN10 to save 10% on your purchase at Scrap Diva Designs. I'll see you in the next crafty video. Bye.